Well, hello everyone, what is going on? It is the Almighty Jeff, and we're here with episode 14 of what could potentially be the finale of Soma. In the previous episode, we managed to uh, make our way through Tower Station and collect the Ark, and uh, there we found the very last human who was alive on um, on the, in the entire infrastructure, possibly even on Earth. And uh, just as to allow her to die, which we did, just uh, that kindness thing, I guess. And uh, we loaded up the Ark to be transported to Tell Station, which to a uh, fire station, sorry, which is where we are now. And um, to do so, we had to make our way through the completely submerged Alpha Station, and we saw uh, the hills. Is that what it was called? I can't remember um, what the guy was called. Uh, but he basically told us that the only way to take down WoW is to basically insert some of the structure gel that makes up our suit, which we did, and uh, we've been amputated our left arm, uh, the guy got killed, and we had to escape the um, Leviathan, and we just about made our way into Fire Station uh, before the end of the episode. Obviously, we're a bit worse for wear, but um, yeah. Chris, what the hell happened to your arm? It's complicated. I just need to know one thing. I'll have both my arms in the arc, right? Yes, of course. Are you okay, though? Can you do stuff? Yeah. Let's just get this over with. Did you find the arc? I did, but I kind of lost it on my way here on an automated tram thing headed to Phi. So it should be around somewhere. That's great. Let's go get it. Okay. So we want to head down to Loading Dock. Right, good. And down the ladder. Oh god. Doesn't look great when you're missing an arm. Not really. For some reason they didn't go through with the launch, so they took the arc back to Tau. I hope everything's okay with the space gun. Yeah, I doubt I'll be able to repair one of those. Uh okay. So we head in here, grab a battery pack, uh, turn around, head left. This feels like should be a, one. yeah, there's a growth. Has it just been one day? I have no idea. Our time together is an amazing patchwork of moments to me. What time is it? What day? It's May 11th, 2104, 3.30 a.m., but I don't remember when we started. Hmm. So right to the wall, there's a panel. You know, I woke up in my bed today. It just happens to have happened a hundred years ago. Sounds like a riddle. It does. I woke up in my bed today, a hundred years ago. <laughs> Who am I? Who am I? Ah, okay. Hmm. Well, right. and there's, there's our boy. Good job, Simon. Now we just need to find the assembly space so we can stuff the ark into a shell. It's crazy to think where I am. Not only is this the future, it's in the middle of a sea. I know nothing of this time or what the world looks like. Not much to brag about now. Before the comet, I guess it was okay. Hmm. Yeah. Better not oversell it. Might change my mind about the Ark. You seriously not going to tell me what happened to your arm? I had to make a quick stop at Site Alpha to help kill the world. What? How? Why? Stop it from torturing the memory of humanity. Okay, let's just get back to work. Wait a minute. What will you do when you get into the Ark? What's the first thing? Make sure the Ark is safe, stabilize flight path, activate solar panels. Well, what's the first human thing you're going to do? Oh. Watch the clouds roll by? Does that count? I'd say so. Hmm. Um Hmm. 
I don't... This is the room to the right of where we entered the room. Well, I don't think this is it. Is it upstairs? Is that what we're doing? Oh! That's the, that's the left guide. Okay. Oh dear. I think I found the assembly space. What do you see? It's like a huge mm. open shell, a bullet ready to be loaded. That's great. All prepared for the arc. On it. Are you suggesting we keep it down here? Doesn't that defeat the whole purpose? Eternity among the stars, remember? The people inside the Ark won't know the difference. We can just keep it down here, and we don't have to risk the Ark being shot through 5,000 meters of broken barrel, and then push through another 100,000 meters of a dust-filled atmosphere. Will the casing stand all that pressure? Well, the odds aren't great. Catherine, say something. I don't care what you think. I'm launching it. No need to be like that. Let's just hang on to it for a while and think about it. We can launch it later. No, that wasn't the deal. We needed to save them, to launch it. Out there, it's hope. Down here, it's a fucking terrarium waiting to die with the rest of us. Come on, Catherine, it's not asking much. Let's just think about it before we risk the only hope humanity has to survive this hell. No, we launch it today. This is my project, my arc. It's bigger than that. Don't you get it? It's not for you to decide. We're talking about the fate of mankind. Get away from the Ark. I'm taking it. No, you're not. I'm not going to let you ruin this. Stop it. Guys, calm down. Get away from me. No. was an accident. Catherine, talk to me. Catherine. Oh crap. Oh, That's Catherine. Catherine. Did you say something? It's you. You had an accident. What are you? Oh. You mean Catherine. Don't worry, it's better this way. How did she die? You got into a fight with your colleagues. They didn't want to risk launching the Ark. Thought it might not make it through the atmosphere. They killed me? I'm sure it was an accident. They were just trying to stop you from launching. Jesus. Right. Uh, put in the pack. How could they kill me? Catherine. I know I'm not an easy person to like. I just thought they trusted me. Come on, don't do this to yourself. Uh huh. Right. It's all ready to go. I'm not that familiar with guns of any size. Oh, here we go. All systems say go. Lock and load. Come back up, and we'll head out to the gun. Did you have friends at right. Toronto, Simon? Real friends? There were some. Jesse, Sean, Kevin. I always wanted a friend, like a real one, someone you'd never hold back with. I'll be your friend. Oh, pity friendship? Now what? Now we just need to get the shell into the gun and then... Kaboom. Aren't you forgetting something? How are you gonna get us on board the Ark? Don't we need to make another scan? Oh, don't you worry. You don't operate something like the Omega Space Gun with your bare hands. You mean... It's a pilot seat? Like back at Omicron? Yes, and we can use it to transfer you to the Ark while operating the gun. Two birds and all that. Now, take the Omni tool and plug it in next to the seat, and I'll guide you through the final steps. Okay. So we got that. Um, let's launch dome. Ah, there we go. Let's go. Oop. Beep the boop. And let's go. Uh, 
Ah, uh, no, not another underwater section. God freaking damn it. Well, hopefully, this is the last. Let's go. Ready. Comfortable? As good as it's gonna get. Okay, I'll activate the seat. You should be able to use the machines to load the bullet you assembled. How do you okay. operate this thing? Don't know when you try <clears throat> But pilot seats are notoriously easy to use, so it shouldn't be a problem. What? Oh. Right. Oh. Put that in there. to the Ark. We also need to make sure it launches at all, so I tied them to a single switch. Just push the button and we're off. Right. Here we go. Here we go. No turning back. Thank you, Simon. Don't mess it. It's an amazing thing you did. And I want you to know I appreciate it. Hope that all goes at a hitch. Just give it a second. I thought you guys would have better bandwidth in the future. Right, that's Catherine updated. Ten oh seconds. god, we're cutting a bit Nine, tight. Eight, seven, Come on! Six, you gotta be kidding me! Five, four, two, Someone boost the Wi Fi! God. <laughs> In a bezel. Loading just before it launched. Yeah, I saw. Then why are we still here? Simon, I can't keep telling you how it works. You won't listen. You know why we're here. You were copied onto the Ark. You just didn't carry over. You lost the coin toss. We both did. Just like Simon and Omicron. Just like the man who died in Toronto a hundred years ago. Uh, this is bullshit. We came all this way. We launched the Ark. I know it sucks. But our copies are up there. Catherine and Simon are both safe on the Ark. Be happy for them. Are you crazy? We're gonna die down here with those fuckers living at large on a spaceship. They're not us. They're not us. I'm sorry you feel that way, Simon. I'm proud of what we did. We made sure that something of the hundreds of thousands of years of human history survives, that something lives on. No, 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 no. Fuck this. Fuck. Fuck this. Fuck you. Fuck you, Catherine, you lied! And I believed in you, I trusted you! You said we're getting on the fucking Ark! We are on the Ark, you idiot! I didn't lie! I can't be responsible for your goddamn ignorance! You fuck! Oh. 
Catherine? Please <laughs> don't leave me alone. Catherine? Catherine? Oh, damn. What an ending. God damn. <laughs> oh, my word. This is such a deep game, man. Um, apparently, there's a post credit thing. Hopefully, it's not too long, the credits, so I can sort of. Uh, I don't have to cut off or anything like that. Uh, but. My god, this was something else. I was not expecting this game to be what it was. It took me a while to get into it. Well, but you probably noticed in the first few episodes, I was sort of. I don't know what's going on here. This is just a bit weird to me. And. Um, but seriously, like the second half of this game really bumped it up to someone else. This was. This is amazing. Um, yeah. Can't sing the praises enough of this game. I've really enjoyed it. Um, shout out to my flatmate, Matt, for uh, recommending uh, this game. I actually got it for free on the PlayStation Store because I've got PlayStation Plus and they'll do the occasional um, free game that they'll sell. And um, I got it off that, uh, got Soma. And uh, it was just sort of resting on my on the hard drive for a while. And then I just when I got to the point where so I decided I wanted to start doing some horrors again. And I knew this was like a, a, a horror puzzle-esque and I knew that it was the same company who made Amnesia. I thought, oh, I've got to get that on there. So obviously I scheduled it to go um, after Outlast. And yeah, I'm really glad I have. This is so it's one of those games that you can only really play once, but it's been like such an experience to play through. Um I know that at the time of recording this, it's not my most, I think it's actually my least watched series. But I've had a phenomenal time with this game, seriously. Um it has been a lot of fun. And uh yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna have a look to see if this company um make any other games or have made any other games, because they've been really good the ones they've done so far. I mean, A Machine for Pigs was a bit meh, but uh, The Dark Descent obviously was a fantastic game, as was this. So I might have to do some more research into that, but um, yeah, I can't believe we've uh, finally done it. And it actually, coincidentally, it lasted the exact same length as, um, as Amnesia Machine... Uh, no, Amnesia The Dark Descent. That was 14 episodes as well. I think we're just coming up to the end of the credits, which is quite convenient. So they say no Batman Arkham Origins, uh, like 30 minute uh, credits. Uh, so yeah, but apparently the guide says that there's a, um, a post credits thing, so should check that out. See what happens next for Simon and Catherine. I assume we're probably going to be on the arc. Oh, yeah, definitely on the arc. We're um, actually have a body. Whoa, is this? Did it work? Wow, it's so weird that the concept that Simon is at the same time both still on, like screaming at the monitor down on the ship, down in the actual infrastructure thing. And also, actually, here on the Ark. I feel so bad for the the the, the Fi Simon, but no, you see, this it's it's such a complex game. Like it's it's honestly something else. This is really good. Um. You know, bro, is it is it sled, Sledgehammer who did this game? I think it's a thing. I can't I can't go remember the exact company, but whoever it was, you know, bravo, this has been someone else. Alright. Calibration survey version 0.3. Welcome. If you're reading this, you've successfully entered the arc. This survey is designed to give you the de give the developers a better understanding of your subjective experience and how to improve your well being through the survey. How do you describe your physical condition? Uh Sure. Just got a mental condition. Feel normal, I guess. So you can't really see into Simon's mind. How would you describe your senses? Who 
Who just got the sensational U condition? Trump, by the fact you are no longer strictly human. Who just perceives your new existence? Do you think this new existence will be a life worth living? Do you have to be removed from the project and accept death? No. Alright. Let's keep her going. I assume there's an ending to this. We've still got one trophy left. Catherine? Oh. I can't believe we actually made it. Well, we did. I'm so relieved. It's okay, son. Everything's all right now. Ah, oh, it's insane, man. Jesus. Yeah, I think I think uh, that's it for humanity. Damn, what an ending shot. Is that it? Is this the end? Bye bye, Ark. So long. See? Yeah, props to Catherine. It worked. The plan to survive, to save humanity. And there it goes. Deep. Damn. <laughs> this has been so weird. Like, it's such it's a it's completely different game. You know, you've got this absolute mind bender. It's like, sort of like, what the hell is going on? And you've got um, the, the horror elements as well. Oh my god, that, that has been that has been amazing. So a look, yeah, we yeah, hundred percent no platinum though, which is sad. But I guess considering it's basically you, you follow it along and do we've got a, sh a shitload of silvers, so that's not too shabby. All right, that is where we're going to end the let's play of Soma. Like I said, a fan, a, you know, a fascinating game. Um, I tell you about yourself, but obviously the sort of like it's sort of like a linear experience. The fact that if you've watched this let's play you've sort of experienced it yourself but i mean if you want to play it yourself then absolutely go for it i mean especially like the scary element it is the, the, there's a couple of times that i yeah it got me uh, but the story thing I, i've really enjoyed the story it's been a really great playthrough so where does that leave us next time well we actually have one more episode of life is strange 2 that we can now get to because that was released during the during the let's play i think actually right back at the start but obviously i don't like interrupting series with another series so we'll have that one last episode of life is strange 2 and that'll be another series that i've completely done and then we shall be moving back into another horror game we've got at least two more scheduled before we move into a sort of different uh, territory and you'll be happy to know that we are going back to Outlast. We're going to pick up on the sequel, so that is going to be really great. Cause I, I loved Outlast, the, um, the first game. It was really good, so I'm thoroughly looking forward to what they can throw with us in the second one. It can only be an improvement, I'm sure. But that's where we are going to end it for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this series. If you did, be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and also be sure to share the video, and I will see you guys in the next one. Bye, guys. Changes.